also if i keep like scratching my face it's because let me show you i keep my brushes on a cup and my cats love rubbing on them and that gets fur on them <laughs> so whenever i use one sometimes i get like fur on my face and i keep doing this that's that's why <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Laura V and welcome, welcome back to my channel. I received my May color curate box. I did this look, spoiler alert. I thought I was getting good doing introductions, I guess not. That's okay, we all here to learn, right? Welcome to my channel. This is my journey of getting better at makeup. <laughs> and I decided to put it on the internet for some reason. Yeah, I unbox a subscription once a month and do some other random makeup related videos if you want to subscribe this is the time go i'll give you like a second to do it it doesn't take long and it's for free great now let's just jump into it i'm going to switch the angle we are going to open the box together and see what i got and then we are going to do this awesome night out ready look even though it's right now 10 a.m but i'm ready for the night <laughs> anyways let's let's just jump into it shall we as always here we have the envelope that it comes in i already know what it is once i see it on my my mailbox because this fits on the mailbox the mailman just packs it like this and shoves it in there and once I open it I already know it's my color curate box let's open this Ta -da. oh it's green nice hey this is pretty I always like the bags that they send but this is cute like I can probably gift this to somebody <laughs> Okay. Mmm, first pick. Look at that. This is a blush duo. It's powder and cream blush. That's cool. The packaging is nice. I got the color Titan. Titian? I don't know how to say this. I usually don't know how to say the names anyway. Chick Rethink. Mmm. You can clearly see which one is the cream and which one is the powder. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, wow. <gasps> I can even use this as like a highlight blush combo. All right, I like this. Da 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 da. Ooh. It's a Trifle Cosmetics product, Illuminating Priming Serum. Oh, and really quick here on the back, it says that it's formulated with plum seed oil and mango extract. Cool. Very summery. Third item. Ooh, what is this? So Susan Cosmetics Cashmere Matte long-lasting matte lipstick oh i love when i get lipstick i got on the shade chestnut this is cool oh and i have more product oh my gosh i can't wait to use this last but not least it's a palette okay Third time is the charm, I guess. Do you think it'll be broken? Like the last two? <laughs> oh, I need scissors for this. Nope. It's a So Susan Cosmetics palette and I got the rose gold. Look at all these shimmers. Are you kidding me? We have to use this. I 
I'm always so excited for collectory boxes because the products are always quality ones. It's just a matter if I like colors, things like that. You know it's true because I'm always mentioning it. My shirt looks weird on the camera, but it's like just a cotton t-shirt and I don't know, I don't know what's going on. So just ignore that. It looks like it's velvet on the camera for some reason. <laughs> It's not. Here we have the first product that we are going to try. It's the primer, which is why you're seeing this beautiful face. <laughs> it's because of this guy over here. We are going to test it out. So on the back over here, it says that the texture is supposed to be like a whipped cream. And like I said before, it's formulated with plum seed oil and mango extract. So I expect this to have a scent that I'll probably like because I love mangoes. <laughs> and then the direction usage right here. It says to massage generously onto cleansed face, which I have right now, neck or body. <laughs> Apply multiple coats for a more intense, long lasting, radiant result. Follow with makeup application. It is supposed to help illuminate and prime my face. I don't usually need help um, illuminating my face because as you can see, I have natural oils for that. <laughs> okay, I see the whipped texture. It does, it does feel like that. All right, let me apply here. Oh, you know what this smells like? It smells like candy. It smells like kids candy. Like the, those ones that you can't really tell the flavor. That's what it smells like. <laughs> and it's not a bad smell, it's nice. I can definitely feel my face like sticky, ready for the makeup. So I'll just skip ahead. I'll apply foundation, color correction, things like that. I'm going to leave the list of everything that I use including a separate section for the products that I received on the box on the description down below. So if you're wondering what I use, I'll leave it there. But let's just skip ahead, shall we? Just really quick over here, they decided to cut the grass and you can hear it very loudly sometimes. And I have an issue of selective hearing basically sometimes i notice the background noise and sometimes i don't so if suddenly you hear it on the background or while i'm editing i decide to just voice over <laughs> that's why <laughs> just a, a parenthesis over here okay so like i said i have the foundation i have a color correction i have concealer i have contouring it's all set I did my eyebrows already as well. And for the next step, I want to do the eyeshadow. Oh my God, I think it's scented. Oh, I don't think so, I, it is. Oh my gosh, it says on the back right here. It says with oregano, golden seal root, thyme, lavender, and rosemary extracts with olive and jojoba oils. I swear to God, I can smell the lavender because I love lavender, so I can definitely smell the lavender. I love this. Um, I have to be very attentive to what I put on my face because it's clearly brown, but my lips have a tendency to turn brown into a mauve. So I have to keep that in mind when I'm doing my, my eyeshadow. I tend to not match the eyeshadow with the lips it's it's an issue and yes also if i keep like scratching my face it's because let me show you i keep my brushes on a cup and my cats love rubbing on them and that gets fur on them <laughs> so whenever i use one sometimes i get like fur on my face and i keep doing this that's that's why <laughs> I'm going to match these two right here, the two opposites on the palette. I want the Idealist to be the main shade. So I'm going to use it on the bottom lash all the way up. And then on the inner corner, I do the quick Zoptic. Sounds like a plan. Holy, such a smooth formula. It literally just glides. Oh my God. And this smell is... I used the same brush on the bottom because I wanted this thick eye moment. <laughs> I'll get another brush 
and tap into the quick zoctic. It turned darker than I thought it would be, but I guess that's okay. <laughs> Let's do a wing. Just a tiny little wing, just to help shape the eye, really. My cat decided to eat and her food is right across from me. This is one of the background noises that I was talking about. I just noticed and she might be eating for a while, <laughs> so yeah. I just applied some brown pencil on my waterline. I just applied some mascara. I have the cream and I have the powder. Like I mentioned before, the powder is definitely a highlighter. It's too pink, too shimmery to be just a blush. The pink tone on that won't go with this copper look. So I'm going to use the cream. I'm just going to apply it with my finger really. Very nice, I like it. Let me apply some highlighter and the fake lashes because I feel like this needs fake lashes since I took this far. <laughs> so I'll come back for the lips. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. Did I just need one coat? It smells like something too. It says on the package that it's scented. Usually I don't like my lipstick to be scented just because it's too close to my nose and I get itchy, I don't know. But I like this one. Guys, are you seeing this? I'm ready for a night out. Hi. <laughs> this is a big reveal, which is not a big reveal if you've been watching the video. If you have not been watching the video, this is awkward. I would recommend watching the first part of the video. I feel pretty. I feel ready for the night. Like, the blush is cute. The lipstick. I have no words for the lipstick. It's so soft. It's a matte, but it's not drying my lips. It's so buttery. Oh my gosh, I love it. Same thing goes for the eyeshadow. Let me close my eyes so you can see it. Don't touch my eyelashes. I'm not good putting them on. I'm ready for the pictures. I'm going to spend the next half hour to an hour snatching pictures because that's what I do. That's why I do makeup for. It's for, for the pictures. <laughs> Let me know in the comments down below what you think of color Curie boxes and what do you think of my look. Anyways, uh, that's it for today's video. Don't forget to click the like and the subscribe button. It would mean a lot to me. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!